Hello YouTube! Today I have another theatre vlog for you. I'm off to the Dominion Theatre to see The Bodyguard. I have never seen The Bodyguard before. It's been in the West End before and also on a UK tour and I've just never been to see it. So I'm really looking forward to seeing it. It has Beverly Knight in the cast and I last saw her in Memphis the musical which I loved. I thought she was fantastic in that. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to seeing it and seeing what I think of it. Hopefully I will really enjoy it. Fingers crossed. Um, I'm not alone today. I'm going to be meeting up with my friends Katie and Bonnie and it's hopefully just going to be a really lovely afternoon. later in the day now you know when you just kind of forget to carry on filming um, because I was obviously with friends that's what happened I have to say though I loved seeing the bodyguard I am really glad that I hadn't watched the film or anything beforehand because I hadn't seen the film the storyline was really fresh and shocking because I didn't know what was going to happen and I'm really glad that I didn't watch the film before seeing the show because there's so many dramatic points and I feel like had I known that they were coming I wouldn't have been as kind of shocked or impressed at the way they they did that on stage. <laughs> I had totally forgotten that because it was a Wednesday matinee Beverly Knight wouldn't be performing and it was Carol Stennett instead and she was fantastic. As I mentioned in the interval sometimes it's really nice to have someone that you don't know playing the role because you really do kind of get more involved in the show because you're not thinking that it's someone playing this character, you just think it's the character. I totally support understudies, I love seeing understudies, so I wasn't annoyed or whatever at not seeing Beverly Knight and leaving the show I I thought I want to see this again so I'm probably going to make an effort to go and see it again with Beverly Knight in. Key points of the show that I really loved were the choreography and the ensemble numbers. 
it was incredible. They are such talented dancers. Some of the moves they were doing were insane. As well, I really enjoyed this set. I thought it was really clever use of kind of multimedia. Um, there's kind of a screen that comes down and then I don't think they're projections as such, but it's just a really clever addition to the show and it definitely works with kind of that angle that they're going with in terms of her fame. Like there's a there's a video at the start which is quite similar to the uh, the trailer, which is kind of X Factorish um, in terms of the video that they show, which is kind of saying about Rachel Moran and how many awards she's won and things like that. It's just really fascinating. The only time I didn't really like that was at the end. Um, my friend Katie and I both agreed that the the drop down screen they used at the end seemed a little bit unnecessary. I kind of, I liked it, but I think it came in too early and looked a bit weird for a while, but I did I did like that that idea and uh, and stage aspect. In terms of the rest of the set, it's kind of like a sliding doors thing, so you'd have bits that came in and then, and then certain bits would move first, and it was really fascinating to watch. I think especially in terms of kind of revealing other pieces of set that are crucial to that moment in the in the show that was a really interesting thing to watch the lighting as well is amazing in some of the scenes in uh in rachel's home the lighting is just perfect it really set the scene amazingly i don't want to babble on too much but i did really enjoy the show and i definitely want to go back and see it again which says a lot when you walk out of a theater and immediately think I would love to see that again. I think it's always really different as well when you do see an understudy the first time around. It's just, I find it really interesting to see different people playing the role. The Bodyguard is on at the Dominion Theatre until the 7th of January 2017, so you've got loads of time to try and see it. Please do let me know in the comments if you've already been to see it or if you're planning to see it and what you thought of the show. If you've enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more from me in the future. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!